Okay, so we've got a bunch of pigs that we've sold, and we wanted to keep three of them to breed back, and we were just going to go to East Tennessee to some people that had some some Yorkshires. They were nothing special, and we were just going to get one of them and take it to slaughter, and then we started thinking, well, we don't really know what it had been fed or all this kind of stuff, and we want to be very intentional about eating and selling stuff that we know what it is so what we've decided to do is is we're going to send uh, one of our one of these sows that we were going to breed to slaughter and we're just going to keep the one that we got from east tennessee so we kept her in the trailer for a couple days with fans and everything else on we gave her wormer we sprayed everything out and with the intention of not bringing any kind of uh, disease or anything like that on the place by accident you know just being super um, super careful probably more careful than we should be but now we're introducing her to the rest of the pigs so i've got ellie over here to the left of the camera you can't see her and she is making sure that i don't back in to uh the the, the wooden pa yeah the, the, yeah the fence that's right and maggie is moving the gate a little bit as we move the trailer back so that they can't get it out And I actually told Maggie, I said, be on the other side of the the gate. See that center divider that she's walking towards right there? I said, be on the other side. Um, so here in a few minutes, you'll hear me. I'll be like, Maggie, I told you to get on the other side of the gate. That's what I really said. What did Ellie say do? She said that we was done, so I walked over to the other side because he said that we was done to open it up to where I could fit through where that trailer was and then go in. And then, and then she said, "No, and I'll go back because we're gonna because we're not done yet." He said that that, that space is too big. What space? The space in between the, fi the the fence and the trailer. So you were just holding it. I don't understand. Okay, whatever. And see, before we filmed this, you can see this pig getting up there. But before we filmed it, all the 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 pigs that was already in the pen, oh, it just changed over. All the pigs that were already in the pen were were standing at the gate because they could hear her in the trailer. So here Ellie opens it up. Ellie, what she what she do whenever you whenever you opened it? What she look like in there? Ellie run around and she, hold it. I thought that she would go a little crazy, but she just standed there and grunted. And she she didn't even move. That's a pig. I need to hold it. Okay, so I yelled for Ellie. I said, "Go over and help Maggie and hold it," because Maggie's on the right side now. I keep thinking that she's gonna get out. You may do. So sometimes, most of the time, that one pig that's fighting her, he's trying. She's trying to. Um, she only puts her front legs in the trailer. How come she not put her back ones in? Don't don't exactly know. But that's that probably helped the 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 pig that was up in there because she was higher. Mm -hmm. If that makes sense. We got a clicker on the ear right there. Mm -hmm. This whole time I'm I keep say, motioning to Ellie and Maggie. I'm like, hold it with your arms, hold it with your arms, because all I can see is one of the the, the sails on the inside hitting that gate and popping it open. The girls falling down and them running out and fighting and just a disaster happening. So. 
hold it good with the other arms like that. There she goes. See that pig? She, she was picking the gate up and pulling it towards her. And so me and Maggie, we were sliding because it was so muddy. The one, the one that was putting it through the panel right there? So you just saw the video kind of flash. We probably cut four minutes of footage out. It felt like it was just taking forever for her to come out, so we end up going and getting the hose. So I, th I think it, yeah, you can see the water right there. We got the hose and we're spraying them. Maybe they'll move back and maybe she'll move back and it kind of speeds everything up. If you look over on the right side of the screen, Maggie and Ellie aren't holding it anymore on the side of the trailer. It's because we took a halter and just, just tied the, the fence. I guess they could have got out, but Like it just did the third hog just go off somewhere else? What happened? What was the third hog doing? I think he's eating. I remember him eating. Oh, out of the feeder on the other side. Mm -hmm. We can see it right here. See, I spray a little water to back up. Spray a little on her, she'll come out. Here it comes. And the pig, he's wagging his tail and he's like, I'm so happy, I've never seen a pink pig before. Everything just seems like it's just going regular. And then look what happens. Boom. So when you want to get his back legs in. His legs are too short. So finally she has enough and she's like, I'm coming out. I'm messing with you. I wasn't really expecting fighting to be a thing to get him out. So you know it's a free for all here. We're scrambling over there to get all the stuff closed and get all the ropes untied. They're still here fighting. I can just see the gate getting crashed through. Because the, the truth is, if they want through, they can just crash through the gate. They can break them panels off. You'll see that here in a minute. Something funny happens. He's just trying to walk away. He ain't even fighting or nothing. <laughs> yeah, they're just, hey, they're just part of the group. They're just doing what the one's doing, you know. Okay, so they're in there. And the day after that, I came back to to do their water, and they had destroyed their entire pan, everything except for their water bucket and and um, the bucket. Oh, turned it over, fighting and everything. Yeah. Yeah. And those things are like heavy. a tornado hit it. Yeah, those things are heavy. Like, you can't even get them, Dad. You gotta get the tractors. So you got this little stuff going on here, too, and then she's still instigating. Won't look at her. You're sniffing her. So we're going to just clean the trailer out and stuff. And we think for, for the most part, you know, they're probably done. You know, they got it behind them. So we undid the camera and moved it. But then they started going after it again. Now watch what happens. She's like, yeah, I think I'll get her some more. Watch this. The 
they're pushing and everything. And they're jumping it. Yeah. It's kind of funny. I couldn't. Mine just spins in circles, so the other one bites it and spins in circles. Watch them jump up, it's crazy. And I never noticed that they had teeth that short. Like when we're also gonna have to trailer, they're big teeth. She's holding her own though. Mm -hmm. Look, she you see what happens? Look, she just she saw me. We locked eyes and watch what she does. She's like, This is the guy who needs help. <laughs> <laughs> she went crashes through the fence. Like I, I, we locked eyes, and then I was like, "Oh no, she's coming over here." Poor thing. Yeah. I haven't been fighting this, mate. Yeah, they, just whenever they get into this to, together, they got to figure out who the boss is. I told the girls, I said, "Girls, the way that she came out of that trailer on onto that pig that was being a bully, I said, if you ever join the Marine Corps, go to prison, God forbid, on both of them." <laughs> But if you ever do that, that's the way you got to handle yourself. You just got to say, listen, you might whip me, but I ain't scared of you. So that's, that's introducing the new pig. Yeah. 